here they are for one and all The moments are about to call Come on and sit down here with me They're here for you on your TV They are the moments They are the moments So come with me, give me your hand I'll take you up to moving land You can fly just like a bird And sing the best song ever heard There were the moments 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 Moomin doesn't normally get up this early. Oh, Snuffkin! Hi there, Moomin! You guessed right. Moomin and his friends are going fishing. And as you know, fish only eat early in the morning. Morning, Snuffkin! Morning! Good morning, Moomin, and you too, little mice. It's mine. a lovely day. We'll catch lots of fish, won't we? Mmm, I'll take you to a very special place for fishing. Good! Oh, I'm gonna catch a mammaloo! There! That's ready now! Snort! Ah? Uh? Are you there? Oh, you've been up all night again, have you, Snork? What are you doing? This is it! But what on earth is it, Snork? Oh, Snork Maiden! Just look at this, such a simple formula! A formula? It's my glue, sis! Of course, it's not ordinary glue. I invented it. It'll stick to anything and everything. To anything? Plastic, cloth, wood, leather, glass, clay, metal, everything. I'm going to start making it right away. Oh. Listen, listen a minute. I'm going off with Moomin and the others now. I won't be back till tonight. Yeah. I've made lunch for you. It's on the table in the kitchen. Oh. Are you listening to me, Snork? Yes. Hmm. Hi, Snork Maiden. Good morning. Good morning. Hello, everybody. I'm ready. We're stopping to pick up Sniff, aren't we? Uh-huh. Ha! That will take some effort, I can tell you. Right. Let's get going. Fishing is so boring. Snuffkin, are you sure this is a special place for fishing? Oh, yes, definitely. Well, if not, I'd rather eat something else. I'm tired of waiting and I'm getting hungry. Wait. Be patient. We'll probably catch an old shoe or something. Or else we'll... Oh, I think we've got a bite. <laughs> what? Whoa. What? <laughs> I got it. It must be a big one. <laughs> Don't rush it, Moomin. Careful. Take it easy. Oh, 
Miss Moomin, you must have caught the very grandfather of all fish here. How clever of you, Moomin. <laughs> we only got one fish after all. Uh-huh, but it's big enough for all of us to eat. That's true. There might even be enough here to fill your belly up for once, Snip. Oh, my. <laughs> Listen, Moomin, are you really going to cook this big fish all by yourself? I certainly am. Cooking doesn't look difficult. Well, it might look that difficult, but... Don't worry. If anything goes wrong, I'll be there to help you. Oh, I don't think that'll be necessary, little Mai. Well, if you need me, I'm there. Why do you all think I need help? You wait. It'll be delicious. All I really need is a good cookery book. Well, all I say is don't ask me to eat it. I like fish baked in an oven, but having said that, I also like it cold in a sort of jelly. I don't think you could make either. Well then, see you tomorrow. Bye! Bye. Bye. Later. Hi, Snork Maiden. I've been making my glue and I'm pleased to say I've just finished. Oh, really, Snork? I've told you time again to do your experiments in your own study. Oh! Oh, 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 I'm stuck. I can't move. Oh, be careful where you walk. I may have spilt a few drops of it. You just need to look to see where you're going, that's all. Oh, look to see where I'm going. Hmm, this truly is a wonder glue. Got something to say to you. Oh, what is it, Smoke Maiden? Get rid of this nasty smoke from this kitchen right away. I can't do that. It needs to be on the stove just a bit longer. You put the glue on my stove? Oh, what have you put in there, Snork? That's my Wonder Glue Magic Mixture. Oh, I'll have you know that is my very, very best soup pot. It was the only one suitable for glue. Oh. <gasps> Here's the soup I made just for you! Oh, and the bowl! Oh, and this one here is my very favorite soup bowl! <clears throat> well, it was sitting right under my nose. Oh, my goodness, Snork, how could you make such a mess? Get your nasty stuff out of my kitchen! I told you I'm in the middle of my experiment. I see. I don't matter to you at all, do I? I never have done. Of course you do, and you know it. I'm just saying this experiment is more important than your favorite soup. It is, is it? You destroy our home, and then you talk about your precious stupid experiments? Well, everyone can live very well without your glue. Snork, maiden. I am going now, Snork. Right. Go. I don't care. Go any way you want. Hmm. I wonder if she meant that. Oh, darn. Oh, what a catch, son. <laughs> I never saw such a big fish in my whole life. Is it all right if I cook it myself, Mama? Of course it is. I think it's too big for us to eat all by ourselves. You're right. That's what I thought, so I've planned a big fish party for tomorrow night, if that's all right with you. Oh, what a good idea. I agree. Mmm, right, and I will bake a fantastic pie for our dessert. Thanks, but I've tried one of your pies before. Oh, that was when the oven was too hot. That's exactly it. <laughs> if you make a pie, Papa, make a plum one. That's Snork Maiden's favorite. Then you'll have something else. You're very kind. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Snork Maiden, aren't you cooking for the Snork? Oh, you see. No, I'm not cooking for him. You're, You're not? not? That's right. There we are, perfect glue. Right. I guess I better eat something. Oh, crap. It's that glue once again. Oh, now the bread's stuck to my hand. That's not me,
fish party day, remember? We have to get things ready, Moomin. Oh, what a lovely day! Breakfast will be ready in a minute, so hurry up! Something smells good in there. I wonder who's making it. It's you, Snork Maiden. A very good morning to you, Moomin Papa and Moomin Mama. Oh my, good morning. Goodness, I see you've made breakfast already. Yes, just thought it was the least I could do. Oh. Good morning, little Mai. What are you doing up so early? None of your business. Good good night, 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 night. Night. <laughs> is good. Not bad. Oh, it really tastes good. Mmm, you'll make someone an excellent wife one day, Snork Maiden. <sighs> ah, nice to know what you're gonna get. Yeah? What on earth do you mean? Nothing. Another thing, Moomin. I filleted the fish for you. That job takes a lot of practice. Hey, My fish? You filleted it already? Yes, I did. And the knife was much too short, though. Oh, no. But I wanted to do it myself, Snork Maiden. But you'd have cut yourself if you'd done it. Oh, listen, little Mai, would you like to help us prepare for the party? Oh, you mean me? Well, since you live with the Moomins, you should do something to help now and then. Oh, come, come, Snork Maiden. You didn't have to do this, you know. No, indeed. We like to have you as a guest, Snork Maiden. Oh, no. I might stay here for quite a while, Moom and Mama, if that's all right with you. And I certainly don't want to be a burden to anyone. Is there something wrong, Snork Maiden? Not really. Only I'm not going back to that insufferable brother of mine, whatever happens. It's wonderful having someone to help, Snork Maiden. Oh, I like housework. Moom and Mama. What's the matter, Papa? I think I'd better go visit the Snork to see if I can sort things out. We must find out why she's so angry with him. Yes, dear. And also he'll be so relieved to know she's safe here with us. Yes, you're right. See you shortly. All right, dear. Good luck. Hmm. Why, yes. I can see you've got a problem. Tell me, what should I do, Moomin Papa? Hmm. Let me think. I have an idea. Why don't you bake Snork Maiden a lovely pie, Snork? A pie? Is that what you think? Yes, make her favorite pie. It can be your way of saying how very sorry you are. And you'll find that once you say you're sorry, you'll realize you are. Oh, but really? She was silly. All right then, but I've never made a pie before, you know. To be perfectly honest, I wouldn't know where to start. Don't worry, I'll help. I'm a good cook. Try to see it as a scientific experiment, and it should be easy. An experiment? Well, yes. Good. In that case, I suggest we start. Right, Papa. Oh, Moomin is such a wimp. He always does whatever Snork Maiden tells him to do. With the lanterns, will you pick some flowers for the table? <laughs> Moomin, hurry up! I still have to make stock for the sauce, you know. You see, it's best to prepare everything before you start grilling. And now you know how! You see how to do it, Moomin? Ah, it's sickening to watch. Oh! Papa. Oh, little Mai. Hello. What are you doing out here then? Aha, I see you've been picking plums. Yes, I'm going to bake a pie. Eh? You gone crazy? No, Moomin Papa's going to help me. It's his way of telling Snork Maiden he's sorry. Oh, right. I'll help as well then. What? Well, well, this is most unusual, little Mai. It is indeed. I didn't know you knew anything about cooking. Ha! Ah, didn't you know? Of course I can bake pies. I've never baked one, but I know how to do it. Ha, ha, ha! Well, I knew there was a catch somewhere. Ha! No 
no pie I made could ever be worse than the ones you usually make. Is that so, Moomin Papa? Well, not exactly, Snork. Could have been a bit better, maybe. You see, the last time the oven got a bit hot, but now I know exactly how to make them. I see. Well, if I read the recipe very carefully, hmm? <laughs> Is everything ready now, do you think? Yes. You know, I couldn't have managed without your help. Oh, but you did most of the work. I don't understand why, but you're very different when you do housework. I can tell you exactly why. Oh, yes, it's all the Snork's fault, and that's a fact. The Snork's fault? He's obsessed with experiments. He never even notices my housework, no matter how hard I work. Hmm. He is an inventor, though, and I'm sure that one day he'll be very famous. He's not like you or me, you know. Oh, oh, I know. I think you might be right. I've been wondering whether I've been too hard on him. I'll say sorry. What do you think? That's a good idea. Is it ready yet? Oh, no, not yet. You've got to need it for ages. Oh, why haven't they invented machines for this? It would be much quicker. There. Mmm, this jam looks delicious. The oven's just right. The dough's not ready yet. Mmm. But what's the problem? It looks perfectly all right to me. Now hit it. All right. But shouldn't you be spreading it out first? Well, yes, but only after you hit it hard with the rolling pin. What a strange thing to do. But you don't know very much about it. If she says so, you'd better try it, I suppose, Snork. She could be right, I guess. It's a lot of mumbo-jumbo anyway. But that doesn't work, Snork. Why not just roll it out? This is most peculiar. Oh, I just remembered what you do next. You sprinkle flour on the dough to stop it sticking. Oh, yes, it's coming back to me now. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba. That's quite enough, little Mai. Yes, it is. Great! It looks perfect! Ah, that looks more like it. And so, between the three of them, Moomin Papa, the Snork, and Little Mai, they finally managed to make a pie. Popper and Little Mai go, do you think? Not that far. I'm sure they should be back soon. Hello, Hello Moomin. Hello, everyone. Oh, welcome to our party. Thanks for coming. Hello, everyone. Hello, Sniff. Oh, has the party started yet? I'm very, very hungry. Oh, Moomin, could you please bring several bottles of apple juice from the kitchen for me? It's all right. I'll get them. I'll, I'll come and help you. Oh, there's Papa, and little Mai, and the Snork. I know. Oh, there you are at last. I'm hungry. Yes. Snork Maiden, your brother's here. What does he want? Just put the bottles on the table. Oh, okay. Come on. We haven't seen you for quite a while, Snore. How's your flying ship coming along? Oh, very well, thank you. I've already finished the working model. Oh, you have, have you? Yes. Mm. <laughs> I smell something good. What is it, Snork? Because whatever it is, it smells delicious. Oh, uh, well, it's nothing very much, really. Snork! Snork, maiden? What happened yesterday? Yes, I'm sorry. It was all my fault. I made you this. An invention? No, not really. But then you could call it that. How kind of you. I can't wait to see what it is. Here, Snork Maiden. Somebody told me you like plum pie. Oh, look at 
Look at that! Also, I, I cleaned out your favorite dish, the one that had the glue all over it. I'm very sorry I made such a mess of the kitchen. Thank you. I'm so happy all of a sudden. Oh, I'm so happy. I love oh. you. <laughs> now, really, Snort oh. Maiden. Now, stop it. Everyone's looking. Yeah. And so Snork Maiden and her brother were the best of friends once again. Everyone could now really enjoy the party. And strangely enough, Moomin's huge fish wasn't too big at all. <laughs>